Every day, the Carrico Athletic Complex comes alive with kids putting in the work needed to win games. The only thing that matters out here is how hard you work, which is something that would make the namesake of this complex very happy. Bill Carrico is a legend in Denton. He was a four-sport star at Denton High, an All-American and Hall of Famer at North Texas, and even played professionally for a while. But it's what he did when he came back to Denton as a coach that made the most lasting impact. Carrico was on the front lines during integration, and it didn't take long for people to know which side he was on. One of the first coaches that I met when I went to Denton High in 1973 was Coach uh, Bill Carrico. And he pulled me to the side at that time and, and, and just welcomed me in. And he treated me no different. He talked to me the same. Uh, he would ask me, did I need anything? Uh, and I saw the relationship between him and the other black coach, Coach Collins. I mean, they were like, he hung with Coach Collins more than he hung with the other coaches. And when I saw that as a player, that let me know that he was real. Therefore, when a confrontation was going to get started, it stopped because they knew Bill Carrico would step in. Not only did he talk the talk, but he walked the walk and you could see it in him daily. Carrico lived his life that way, not because he was told to, but because for him, it was the only way to live. He was for right. If you were right, you know, if you were wrong, even if he liked you, I was his quarterback and if he caught me doing something wrong, he would pull me to the side, you know. But he didn't disrespect you when he, when he talked to you of something you were doing wrong. He still talked to you with respect. The things that they instilled in me as a young black man, I use those things today. Uh, those things took, have taken me a long way through life, and I still think about those things, and I live the way they lived. Carrico lived to help others, sometimes on the field, but even more often away from it. He left quite a legacy, and now Denton ISD has an athletic facility that lives up to his name. I think we have probably the best facilities that I've seen at the high school level in the, in the state of Texas. Knowing that everything is new and we have a lot to use, everything that we need is here. It makes us all want to come every day, use our new equipment. I was blown away. It's just, it's such a great facility and I'm very fortunate to play here. All of the visitors that come in, they're always like, oh wow, this is really nice. Like they never say it to us, but you can hear it when they come in. The beauty in this place is space. Everyone has their own area to call home, which is a big deal when you have to service one of the fastest growing schools in Texas. There's not one sport, you know, more important than another. Each each sport has a great space. Each coach has their own uh, office, um, and so I think the just the, the parity across the board with our sports and and the spaces that we have with different buildings, and I, I think it's a great great layout. It's a very big deal because before we had to share with basketball, and it was a mess walking into the field house, seeing a million people already in there, and then you had to join in the chaos. And sometimes we'd be late to class and. I love it here because it's like a second home to me. It was a real nice like breath of fresh air to get to come here and uh, use brand new equipment and use, have more space and everything that just like hasn't ever been used before and just be the first ones. It almost feels like we're getting kind of like spoiled, you know. This facility is much nicer than any that Coach Carrico used during his four decades as a coach and administrator in Denton. People that know him say he would be overjoyed to know that his name is on a complex that will shape so many lives. I'm so proud, just like I am for Coach Collins. Uh, I am so proud for his wife, his family, because nobody in Ditton deserves that more than uh, Coach Bill Carrico.